<laughs> Seriously? What happened to keeping a low profile? Relax, Marty. There's no one in this section. Okay, just as long as we leave everything exactly how we find it. Huh? Are those grizzly slippers? Pretty cool. They sure are. Go ahead, Marty. Try them on. I, I probably shouldn't. Wear me, Marty. I'm so lonely without feet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll try on the slippers if you stop doing that voice. Fair enough. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. That's so fuzzy. It's like walking on a cloud. Is this what it's like to have paws? Welcome to the padded life. I mean, what are these things made of? Air? I think they're just made of slipper material, but it could be wrong. <laughs> <gasps> what was that? Sounds like something's out of place. Wow, they're comfy and super duper loud. Awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no! We gotta get this stuff back in place! I can't leave these slippers like this! You can fix them at home! Oh, fine. Hi! Nobody's here. Well, somebody's gotta clean this up. I miss the mirrors at Fancy Fifths. Yeah, it's too bad we didn't get to have more adventures at the store. It may be all fun and games for you, but I need to maintain my spotless reputation. I'm never going back to Fancy Fifths again. The park rangers pay attention to every detail, and so do I. There, all cleaned up. If you're never going back to Fancy Fifths, how do you plan on returning those slippers? <sighs> I guess I'm gonna miss that detail. It's okay, Marty. We'll just take them back and explain what happened. You can talk to the fancy inspector's dog. He'll understand. Yeah, it was an accident. We all spill a vase of flowers on a pair of slippers in the fancy store in New York sometimes. Uh, no way. Not me. But, Marty... Ranger horses are supposed to clean up messes, not make them. If anyone finds out I did this, my reputation will be in worse shape than those slippers. So we'll just forget <laughs> this ever happened. Consider this mess cleaned. <sighs> Congratulations, distinguished graduates of the Park Ranger Horse Academy. Finally, I'm about to become a real Park Ranger horse. Ranger Marty, ah! welcome to the force. Thank you, ma'am. Huh? Ranger Marty, what is the meaning of this? <gasps> oh, well, I had a little accident with the slippers. How are you supposed to keep the park safe and clean if you're the one creating messes? No, no, I can't explain. See, I took them from Fancy Fifth, so I... <gasps> First you destroyed the slippers and then you took them? No ranger badge for you, 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 you. No! <gasps> there, darling. Home at last. <gasps> this is even better than I imagined. <coughs> Big screen TV playing a nature show? Check. Cat jacuzzi? Check. Giant feather bed? Check. Mommy's got to run. I'm off to my board meeting. It's caviar donut day. I'll be back to tuck you in for your cat nap. I hope Sir Braxton was able to explain the whole switcheroo to Gloria, Melman, and Marty. Mountain of pillows and silk pillowcases? <gasps> Check. <laughs> Is it just me, or has Alex been awfully quiet? Now that you mention it, I can't think of any time in the history of ever that Alex has been this quiet. Alex, are you feeling okay? Oh, I'm feeling quite peachy. Thank you for inquiring, old chap. <laughs> Alex, what happened to your voice? It sounds fancy. Who are you and what have you done to our friend Alex? Allow me to introduce myself. I am Subraxton. The one you call Alex and I have switched places for the day. Is this one of your 
characters, Alex? Because if it is, I have a few notes. No, Melman! Alex switched places so he could spend the night in that fancy hotel. This guy... <clears throat> Sir Braxton? Sir Fancy Pants is his replacement. His replacement? But where's the real Alex? Alex is in good hands. Now, would someone kindly give me the grand tour of my quarters? Uh, sure. That's the water, that's the cave, and that's the grass. Grass? Fascinating. I knew Alex wanted some space, but a heads up would have been nice. What if Kate finds out? Oh, a Kate! What's a Kate? On the other hand, this cat has better manners and smells better than Alex. I understand <gasps> your concern, but I vow to be on my best behavior. I am a prized Maine Coon, after all. Okay, fine. But tomorrow, this little switch room is getting shut down. I hope the real Alex is okay. Oh, <laughs> fear not, tall one. He's living like a prince right about now. <sighs> I think I could get used to this. Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Woo! I got everything I've ever dreamed. Feel like a star on a movie screen. Finally, some wide open air. A simple life without a care. It's like the world's at my command. A magic natural wonderland. It's everything I've ever wished. Who are This. My head in the clouds and my feet on the ground If only all my friends could see me now I'd tell them that I, I could get used to this All of us glamour and all of us bliss And nobody I have to share it with I could get used to this Sir Braxton, it's room service with your daily hashed browns. I'll leave it outside the door. <gasps> yeah! I am a hash brown kind of lion. As long as you're asking, we could choose a bit of help with something, if it's not a bother. What is it? Anything. My mates and I have a band. We're supposed to play a party tonight, but we didn't have our instruments with us when we got blocked from our home. So even if we get back in time to play, I'm afraid we shan't be warmed up. Oh, no. We don't have musical instruments here. That's OK. We use fanned objects. We especially love shiny things that sound good when they're hit. It's sort of the rat way. I suppose there must be stuff around here you could use. Riley here loves a good bass. Bum, ba, dum, ba, ba, bum, bum. And Raphael is partial to the drums. Boop, ba, scat, boop, ba, ba. If you could be so kind. If I could be so kind. Uh, hello? I'm finding instruments for the rats so they can play them. Mm. <gasps> huh. Yippee! Fancy that. Ta-da! Now you have drums. Oh, lovely. You've been more than generous. <laughs> now, do you have any materials for a guitar? Hmm, I've got just the thing. Alex, can I have the teensiest bit of yarn for some guitar strings? Gloria, my yarn balls are really special to me. So is that a yes? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> dear, dear, it's okay. <sighs> it's some dental floss from the lost and found. Marty let me have it. <sighs> it might be used. <laughs> Scavengers can't be choosers, we rats always say. This is perfect. You've truly gone above and beyond. And I would hate to impose, but have you something we could blow into? Like a bottle or something? <sighs> Coming right up.
Congratulations! Hello! What the? These are some more of me mates. Uh. We're not crowding you, are we? Oh, um, well, to be honest, <laughs> kick your claws up, by all means. The hot tub's all yours. Enjoy. <laughs> oh, I guess I'll head on over to the slide to make more broom. <gasps> Wait, I was about to use that. <laughs> no problem. Get in line behind me. Hey there. Hey. The line ends here. Wait, how many of you are there? Mates, step aside. Let's not impose. It's okay. If they're having fun, I don't want to get in the way. Woohoo! Good times. Woohoo! We'd better wait. Tank's too full. How could the tank be full already? The water's great. Thank you for the invitation, Gloria. We're having so much fun. I'm so glad. Woo -hoo -hoo! We might even take you up in your offer and stay a while. Right, mates? <laughs> yeah. How much longer can they possibly stay in there anyway? Fun fact, rats can swim for three days straight. Three days? 